90% of people are dehydrated. Everyone will tell you just drink more water, but that's actually destroying your health. Here's eight critical keys to real hydration. And I promise you, your doctor's not gonna tell you this. The first one, mineral balance, why it matters. Your cells need minerals to actually absorb water. Without them, you're just flushing out nutrients and making things worse. How to get it? First and foremost, only use high quality salt. Add a fourth of a teaspoon of sea salt per 32 ounces of water, and just make sure to space your water intake throughout the day. If you're looking for a high quality hydration salt, here's my favorite by far. This is Relight Hydration by Redmond Salts. You've probably seen their salts everywhere. This is great, my kids drink that. I use the stick packs. I'll tell you why I love this product so much. They use salt from their own mine out of Utah. They own the mine, they mine the salt, they put in their products. They are fantastic. There's a link below if you wanna try those out. The second one is cellular hydration, why it matters. Your body is like a battery. It needs minerals for conductivity. Without proper cellular hydration, all systems fail. How to get it? One ounce of water per pound of body weight daily. Stop drinking two hours before bed. Add minerals to every glass. Maintain a consistent intake. The third one is the exercise protocol. Why does it matter? Because working out depletes electrolytes fast and most sports drinks, they just make dehydration worse. So how do you get it? 24 ounces of water per hour of training. Add electrolytes post-workout. Focus on cellular absorption and double your mineral intake. The fourth one, natural hydrators. Why does it matter? Certain foods enhance hydration at the cellular level better than water alone. How to get it? Watermelon. I love watermelon and I'm sure you do too. Everybody loves watermelon. 92% water plus electrolytes. Cucumber, 96% water plus minerals. Citrus fruits, cellular support. Coconut, natural electrolytes. Got the point? Number five is hidden dehydrators. Why it matters? Because common healthy habits are secretly destroying your hydration levels. How to avoid? Cut alcohol. It's a massive dehydrator. Eliminate processed foods, lower coffee intake. Number six, absorption timing. Why does it matter? Because when you hydrate affects how much water your cells actually use versus waste. How to time it. Drink between, not during meals. Start immediately upon waking. Space intake throughout the day. Stop two hours before bed. Seven, electrolyte balance. Why does this matter? Without proper electrolytes, water goes right through you, making dehydration even worse. How to balance it with food. Sodium, sea salt, potassium, avocados, calcium, mineral water, and magnesium, leafy greens. Or you can take an electrolyte supplement. Look for the ones without artificial ingredients or flavors that are low or contain no sugar. Eight, quality matters. Why does it matter? Because most water sources are doing more harm than good. What to choose? Spring water, mineral rich sources, properly filtered water. Never tap, never use plastic bottles. The bottom line, it's not about drinking more water. It's about getting water into your cells. Most people are doing everything wrong. But if you just make these few changes, you'll notice a huge difference in your daily life. Better cognitive function, way more energy, and if you get headaches, they disappear. Lastly, get your damn labs done. Our FitScript 124 biomarker test even measures your hydration levels. This way you know exactly where you stand because you can improve what you don't measure. There's a link somewhere, probably below. Click it to schedule a free health assessment call with my team. Now subscribe because you know this video was fire and it motivated you to be better. I'll see you in the next one. Let's go.